I wanted to film a video in my kitchen because I want to take advantage of the natural sunlight coming through. Also, I thought I would discuss what's on my mind and uh, while I do my makeup. So I just feel like putting my face on today. I don't wear makeup every day. If I do wear makeup, I like to keep it very simple and minimal uh, just because I don't enjoy the removal process, if I'm being honest, at the end of the day. So I have um, some foundation and that's about it. And I put uh, lip product on, I'll show you, natural, although it's going to be covered later by my mask. For the purpose of the video, I will show you what I enjoy putting on my uh, lips. Beauty sponge, this is by L'Oreal, just a drugstore. So what I wanted to talk about was one of the, I think one of my most common remarks, comments that I get on my videos is people uh, telling me or asking me to smile more or why don't I move my face, make facial expressions and things such as this. And it got me thinking, well, the answer to that is because when I have a reason to smile, I do smile, but I don't unnecessarily emote and express because I'm just, this is my personality and I'm not going to put on a fake um, persona to show to YouTube, I guess, um, that, you know, that it's not me, that just for the purpose of uh, pleasing other people or I guess fitting into some this is exactly what I wanted to talk about is I guess I guess I think I wonder if men get this comment when men don't smile I wonder if men are told to smile or if it's just directed mainly towards women I think there is this odd expectation or it's not even an expectation, but I think there is this strange thing that women seem to get more um, when we don't, when when we're not very smiley, <laughs> or um, I guess I don't know. I honestly don't know. And a lot of people say that my face looks frozen, or you know that because I don't smile and I don't express, but this is my face. I'm not going to, uh, I'm not going to pretend I'm something or somebody I'm not, uh, just because I'm choosing to share myself on social media. It would be strange, I think, if I all of a sudden just started to be performative you know, for instance, when I'm washing my face and people say, you don't seem to move your face a lot. Um, let me tell you what, where my mind goes <laughs> with that comment. And it might just be my neurologically atypical self. But when people say you don't move your face when you're washing your face, <laughs> what I picture is I picture a Mr. Potato Head moving his face all around. <laughs> and I thought, I picture myself as that moving my face all around because that's that's where my mind goes. Um, I know that's not what you mean, but that's where my brain goes. But uh, so this is pretty much all I do uh, when I want to put makeup on, and then I will usually brush through my eyebrows. Although. My eyebrows are very um, full, as you can see, but I use a spoolie to uh, brush through them. They're unruly, but I just let them be natural because I prefer to just uh, let them exist on my face the way they will. And then um, for my lips, I will show you although I'm usually covered with a mask. I use a L'Oreal um, lip liner in uh, natural. 
and I don't line my lips with this. I more uh, pounce this on my lips and then I use my finger. Very sophisticated method. <laughs> but this is actually what I do, so. I just uh, pat this on my lips very haphazardly, actually, and then I take uh, the healing ointment and I would be really curious if men get comments like telling them to smile. I don't unnecessarily express because, well, number one, I just don't. <laughs> but number two, you know, unnecessarily making expressions over time, it causes wrinkles. And so if I can do something to prevent that, then I'm not going to certainly encourage, you know, that which I can prevent by just simple lifestyle practices like keeping a relaxed facial expression. It, it shines a light on a bigger issue, like I said, about beauty standards and I guess gender roles even to, to a larger extent is that women especially, I think, are expected to be smiley and put on a certain air about themselves to make them more to seem less uh, intimidating perhaps or more inviting and I don't live my life that way I don't wish to appease anybody I would love to know your thoughts on this topic uh, you can leave them in the comments down below and we can start a discussion so here's the final look I guess if you can call it a look uh, just a light layer of uh, foundation and uh, the lip liner and CeraVe uh, healing ointment. I'm going to enjoy the lovely sunshine. I wish you well, stay well, and you shall see me soon.